Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Face of Sagist and welcome back to Sims 2. This time we're taking a look at the Athletics The Athletic Career Track and basically all of the trans cards, how much money you will make per week for all of the tiers, and the career award. The career award is basically this punching bag, which you get when you reach level 5 of the athletic career track. So that is basically halfway through the career track. And this one is also a unique one, it's probably the best one out there for building skills. It provides the, uh, what you would call it, the body skill at a rate of 313%, which is much better than regular gym equipment and working out. Now, in any case, let's get to the juicy details, because everybody likes money. Uh, basically, your first job is a team mascot. <clears throat> you are free on Mondays and Thursdays, and you're going to need athletics, charisma, mechanic, and friends. For the first career track, you won't need any of those. And you will make 770 simillions per week. Now let's move on to the minor leaguer. Uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays you are free. You're going to need one athletic point in order to advance. And you'll be making $1,190 per week. Okay. That was... Okay, the next one is Rookie. Basically, you're free on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. You will need two athletic points and Yeah, basically two athletic points in order to advance and you'll be making 1610 simillions per week Now the next one is starter And you're free on Tuesdays and Thursdays You're going to need three athletics and one charisma and one friend in order to advance and you'll be making 2,100 per week. The next up is All Star. On this level, you actually get the punching bag. You're free on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You will need six body, two charisma, and two friends in order to advance. And you'll be making 2,695 simillions per week. The next one is MVP. You're basically free on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. You will need 8 Athletics, 3 Charisma, 1 Mechanical, 1 Mechanical Skill, and 3 Friends. You'll be making 3,572 per week. The next one is Superstar. You're free on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and you will need 10 Athletic, 4 Charisma, 2 Mechanical, and 4 Friends. And you'll be making 5,950 per week. Now the next one is assistant coach, you are free on Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays and you will need 10 athletics, 5 charisma, 4 mechanical and 5 friends in order to advance and you will be making 5,952 per week. The next one is coach, you are free on Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays. You will need 10 Athletics, 7 Charisma, 7 Mechanical, and 6 Friends in order to advance. And you'll be making 7,000 per week. Now, the last one is Hall of Famer. You're free on Sunday, Saturday, Friday, and Monday. You will need 10 Athletics, 10 Charisma, 7 Mechanical, and 8 Friends. And you'll be making 9,099 simillions per week. Now, let's talk about chance cards. Taking back from the bottom basically for the team mascot you have two options. The first one is become limpy, steal the limelight and for become limpy there's an 85% chance that you will gain plus one athletics plus one creative and a 14% chance that you'll lose 150 simillions. The other option stealing the limelight has a 14% chance of giving you plus two charisma and an 85% chance of getting fired. So become limpy or just skip. 
The second one, Minor Leaguer, has two options. The first one is move piano or make excuse. Now if you move the piano, there's a 15% chance that you'll gain plus one athletics and plus one charisma, and an 84% chance that you will lose one athletic point. If you make an excuse, there's an 84% chance that you'll gain plus two logic, and 50% chance that you'll lose a day's pay. Which really sucks, I would recommend that you skip this one entirely. For the third one, Rookie, you have a Return Brace and Hide Brace. Those are your two options. The first option, Return Brace, is an 85% chance to give you plus 2 Athletics and a 14% chance that you lose 1000 Simeleons. And if you hide the Brace, there's a 40% chance that you'll get promoted to Starter, which is the next level of the Athletics career. And an 85% chance that you'll get fired. Uh, if you're desperate for athletic points, go with the return brace. That's your, well, basically safe bet where you're gambling. Now, for a starter, you have two options. The first one is to take a deal or to pass on it. If you take a deal, there's a 15% chance that you'll gain 20,000 simoleons. Or an 84% chance that you'll lose one charisma. If you pass on it, there's an 84% chance that you'll gain plus one logic and plus one charisma, and a 50% chance of no penalty. So passing on it is good. If you feel like gambling, go with the first options that will give you money, and if you fail, you'll only lose one charisma point. For the all-star, you have two options, practice or play golf. If you practice, there's a 50% chance that you gain plus 2 Athletics and plus 2 Charisma, and an 84% chance that you can lose 15,000 Simeleons. Uh, so we're just going to skip the practice option. If you play Golf, there's an 84% chance that you'll gain 4,000 Simeleons, and plus 2 to Charisma, and a 15% chance that you lose 1,000 Simeleons and 1 Charisma point. So go ahead and play Golf. Now MVP, you have two options, take pills or take herbs. If you take the pills, there's an 85% chance that you'll gain plus 3 charisma and a 40% chance that you'll actually get fired. So we're actually going to skip that and take herbs, there's a 40% chance that you gain plus 2 athletics and plus 2 charisma, but an 85% chance that you lose a day's pay and you lose to Charisma. So we're just going to skip that one entirely. For the Superstar, there are two options that you can take. The give the Heimlich Maneuver or find a manager. If you give a Heimlich Maneuver, there's a 85% chance that you get promoted to Assistant Coach and a 40% chance of losing $20,000. That is a millions. If you go to find the manager, there's a 40% chance that you gain plus 2 logic and an 85% chance that you lose minus 2 charisma and minus 2 mechanical. I would recommend that you skip this one because 20,000 simoleons, it, it's a big risk. <clears throat> okay, for the assistant coach, there are two options, obviously. Ask rookies or pay the movers. If you ask the rookies, there's an 84% chance that you'll get fired and a 15% chance that you gain plus free logic and plus 2 charisma. So skip that one. If you pay the movers, there's an 84% chance that you'll get promoted to coach and a 15% chance that you'll lose 12,000 simoleons. If you want to get promoted quickly, pay the movers. Risk it if you want. That would be my suggestion. Now, for the ninth one, for the coach, you ha you'll have two options, cut players or cut expenses. If you cut the players, there's a 50% chance that you'll gain plus 25,000 simoleons and plus 2 charisma, and an 84% chance that you'll lose free charisma. If you cut expenses, there's an 84% chance that you'll gain plus 2 charisma and plus 2 logic, or a 50% chance that you'll lose 2 charisma and 1 athletic. So, I know I'm honest to just skip that one. Okay, for the Hall of Famer, which is the top track, you'll have 
two options smile pretty or make a speech if you smile pretty there's a 50 percent chance that you'll gain 50,000 simoleons and if you fail there's a 84 percent chance that you'll lose 50,000 simoleons if you go ahead and make a speech there's an 84 percent chance to gain 40,000 simoleons and a 50 percent chance to get fired make a speech it's worth a gamble in all honesty 40,000 simoleons it'll tie you over in case <laughs> Uh, if you get it, but if you don't get it, you're basically out of a job. So, if you feel like gambling, go ahead and do that. In any case, that's it for athletics.